Hold up. We need to stand up. Close your eyes. Join your hands. And now start your prayer with a little smile. Now, let's get into the lesson. Do you know which subject we are going to learn today? Can you guess? Yes? Yes, correct. It's English. And I have some surprise for you. And now, shall we repeat all this joke once? Repeat after me. Standing line. Standing line. Standing line. This is sleeping line. Sleeping line. Sleeping line. This is right slanting line. Right slanting line. Right slanting line. Right slanting line. This is left slanting line. Left slanting line. This left slanting line and this is curve. This is a right curve. Right curve. And this is left curve. Left curve. This is a circle. Circle. This is a circle. And this is zigzag. 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 This is zigzag. How to write it now? Standing line. Start from the top to bottom. Standing line. Sleeping line. Right slanting line. Left slanting line. Curve. Right curve. Left curve, circle, zigzag. And now, let's draw few drawings using all the strokes. Okay, are you ready?
Yes. Standing line. Standing line. Sleeping line. Sleeping line. Right slanting line. Left slanting line. Standing line. Sleeping line. Standing line. Circle. Big bag. Line. Slanting line. Slanting line. Circle. Planting line. Can you see it here clearly? Can you draw this? Good. Now, now let's write some alphabets using some strokes. I. Shall we repeat it once? Slanting line, slanting line, and sleeping line makes letter A. One standing line, one left curve, and right left curve makes B. One left right curve, and one right curve makes letter C. One standing line and left curve makes letter D. One standing line, one sleeping line, and one more sleeping line, and another sleeping line makes letter E. One standing line, one sleeping line, and one sleeping line makes letter F. And one Right curve and one standing line makes letter G. And standing line and sleeping line, this is standing line. That makes letter H. One sleeping line and one standing line and one sleeping line makes letter I. So, practice this at home. It's your paper and pencil. Now, let's sing an alphabet song and try to sing along with me.
I hope you will learn and sing along with me in the next class. See. And now let's learn alphabet pictures. This is A. Capital letter A. Small letter A. A for apple. A for ant. A for aeroplane. And next, this is B. This is capital letter B. And small letter B. B for boy. B for bus. B for ball. And next, this is C. Capital letter C and small letter C. C for cat. C for car. C for cow. This is capital letter D and small letter D. D for dog. D for drum. D for dolphin. And next, this is capital letter E. And this is small letter E. E for elephant. E for engine. E for eagle. And next, this is any guess? G, small letter G, G for girl, G for gift, G for gun. Next, capital letter H, small letter H, H for hen, H for house. H for hat. And next, the last letter is I. Capital letter I and small letter I. I for ice cream. I for igloo. I for ice. So now you have all the pictures. In this book, so every day keep practicing all the pictures in this book till the letter starts from A to B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. Practice it till you are. Kids, now it's time to write. So open this book. This is English handwriting book. Open this book. And Mamta Ma has already taught you all this standing line. I hope everybody has finished writing this slanting line, right slanting line and left slanting line and C right, right curve and left curve letter A Letter B, letter C, and letter D, letter E, 
letter S. And now we are going to match this. Match the letters to the correct pictures. B. Where does this match? Is it an aeroplane? No. B for fox? No. B for ball? Yes, correct. B for ball. And D. Where does this go? D for aeroplane? No. D for fox? No. D for eagle? No. D for doll? Yes, correct. D for doll. Next. What is this? Letter A. Where does this go? Does this go here? A for cow? No. A for eagle? No. A for fox? No. A for aeroplane? Yes, correct. A for aeroplane. What is this? Letter F. Where does this go? Does this go here? F for cow? No. F for eagle? No. F for fox? Correct. F for fox. What is this? C. Where does this go? C for eagle? No. C for cow? Yes. Correct. C for cow. E for eagle. Very good. Next. Tick the pictures whose name starts with letter G. Does giraffe start with the letter G? Yes. Then put a tick mark. Does tiger starts with letter G? No. Does grapes starts with the letter G? Yes. Put tick mark. Now let's start letter G. Children, complete this page. And this. Now let's go with the next letter. Tick the correct picture whose name starts with letter H. Does snake starts with the letter H? No. Does house starts from letter H? Yes. Put a tick mark. So hen. Hen starts with letter H? Yes. Then put a tick mark. How to write letter H? One standing line. One sleeping line, one more standing line, letter makes H. Children, complete this page and this. And next, tick the pictures whose name starts with letter I. Now, this is letter I. I does ice cream starts with letter I? Yes. Then put the tick mark. Then I starts with letter I. Yes, then put a tick mark. Does penguin starts with the letter P I? No. Then leave it off. How to write? One sleeping line, one standing line, and one sleeping line letter makes I. To complete this page and this. And the next will be in the next class. Dear parents, this is English four-line book. Make your children to write this strokes using these dots. And here, here you have four lines. There's pink line, blue line, one more blue line and one more pink line. So here, this, this is a standing line. Kids. Just observe, this is standing line, this is sleeping line, 
from this dot to this dot. This is slanting line, right slanting line, left slanting line, right curve, and this is left curve from this dot to this dot. Zig, zag line, and one circle. So complete this page and let's move on to the next. Write the alphabets using the dots. Right slanting line, left slanting line, and one sleeping line. Standing line, left curve. One more left curve makes B. One standing line and one left curve makes D. One standing line, one sleeping line, one more sleeping line and one more sleeping line makes E. Standing line, sleeping line, sleeping line makes F. From this dot to this dot makes right slanting line, right curve, standing line, sleeping line, and one more standing line. This makes G. Standing line, and one more standing line, and one sleeping line makes H. Sleeping line, and one more sleeping line, and one standing line makes I. Thank you. I hope you will finish all this work and come in the next class. Thank you. Dear parents, make your child to write one page a day for homework. Please help your child to write themselves using dots. Make sure your child is saying it out louder and write them, which makes them easier yes, to remember. I well. hope you have learned many things today. You learned strokes, alphabets and alphabet pictures. Practice at home and learn it well and I'll come again in the next class. Thank you.